A-level chemistry, paper due predictions, and last minute revision tips from an A-star student, AKA one of my best friends who did in fact get that A-star in A-level chemistry. And I'm here to give you all of his tips. I will start with revision tips and then get on to predicted questions. First things first, when you are drawing structures, make sure in your displayed formula, you show all bonds. But when you're doing your skeletal formulas, make sure you show all of your functional groups except for your alkyl chain. Make sure you're drawing your bonds in the right way because otherwise you will be penalized and a mark will be taken away from you. Same with any alcohol groups or functional groups. Just be aware of that in the exam and do not make any silly mistakes like this. Mechanisms, you need to know them really, really well. Nucleophilic addition, electrophilic addition. I have been informed that these are some of the easiest marks to get on the paper. You just need to know it. However, little caveat, they usually come up in unfamiliar situations. So you'll just need to apply your knowledge to a new setting. So try out some practice questions using different alkenes, alkane, things like that. You need to have a good foundation of knowledge for every single topic. The thing with chemistry is there's so much to know, you can really get into the nooks and crannies of every topic. As in every topic has some really small, minute details that you might think are oh, quite insignificant. However, they love to put those things into the exam because they know that people won't revise them. It's important to get that high level understanding of everything first and foremost because that's where most of the marks will come from. However, knowing those specifics for each topic will really help you get that A star. Now on to exam predictions, things that come up every year, the things that haven't come up in a while. First and foremost, there are topics that come up every single year. As in you can't get away from them, they've come up every single year since linear A levels were implemented. These topics are carboxylic acids, halogen alkanes, rate equations, nuclear magnetic resonance spectroscopy, I cannot say, aromatic chemistry. You cannot get away from those topics. I highly, highly recommend. If you are not confident with all of those, go and do some practice questions because they are almost guaranteed to come up. And out of those, we consistently see rate equations is worth the most amount of marks on basically every paper. Closely followed by carboxylic acid, amount of substance, halogen alkanes, and nuclear magnetic. Yeah, that one I can't say. Required practicals are usually worth a big chunk of marks each year. So please just know them. These practicals, you've already done them. You've already applied your knowledge to them. It's not as if you're applying your knowledge to a new situation. So just make sure you know them and be prepared for a question on them. If you have any more exam predictions, be sure to leave them in the comments and follow for more daily A-level tips.